there are 100 billion fixed stars in galactic space. There are also 3 billion nebulae in the crocosm. Each is as big as galactic space. Old stars explode and scatter as gas. From there, new stars form from the scattered gas again. What secrets are hidden in these countless stars? Among these stars, one of them is in trouble. Astronomical observatories from all over the world caught an amazing wave. It sounds like an irregular wave that might have been sent from outer space. Now the waves have stopped. However, we cannot confirm yet if they are messages from the spacemen or not. Dr. Shiga, the same electric waves were caught in England uh, last year accordingly. Are they the same one? No, that was different. The one before was from beyond the solar system, we think. But this one is very much nearer, according to our calculations. Does that mean people on solar are the same system planet? No, that's hard to say. You have that ready? There's no air or water on the moon, so no living thing inhabits it, as you know for sure. And there are no rivers on Mars. And on Venus, it has several hundred degrees centigrade. And the surface of Jupiter is covered with frozen ammonia. Saturn is also the same. No advanced vertebrates there, of course. So what do those waves mean? Assuming they come from Proxima Sinori, which is nearest to us, how long will it take Apollo, one of the newest spaceships, as you know, how long will it take us to get there, do you think? Five hundred thousand years. Gentlemen, right now, even if we received an invitation from the spacemen, we can't meet them unless they come. And it's only a dream yet for everybody. <laughs> They're a spaceman, or those waves wouldn't have come. Tom, Tom, I see something funny flying. What? what? Look. What is it? What is it? Um. Tom, it's a spaceship. What? what? Let me look too. No, no, 
Let me look first. Akio, let me look too. Stop bothering me. Akio, it's a spaceship, isn't it? Uh huh. But I can't see it. It came down near the river. Akio, come on, let's go see. Okay, let's go. Take me too. came down on the vacant lot where we play. Yeah. Akio! Akio! Oh, it's Mother. We won't get scolded again. Oh, we're in trouble. Listen. Now, I thought you were studying, but looking at the stars again, huh? Mother, we saw a spaceship. You imagine it. Don't stay up late. You too, Tom, if you want to stay. You better listen to me. Yes, ma'am, but we want to watch the stars every night to... I know. You want to find new stars and name them Akio and Tom stars. Am I not right? That's not all. Some of the papers said waves were caught from the outer space. Systematically, too. It might have been the spacemen that they heard. That's why we've been trying to find which stars. They may be very civilized up there, more than we are here on Earth, with no wars or traffic accidents. And we'd never know that. There's no such star. Behavior, I'll take away your telescope. Grown-ups have no dreams. Come on, no more foolishness. Go to bed. Yes, yes mother. mother. Tomorrow? OK. kids again. Hey, wait. I said, stop. 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 What's this? And you come back, too. Mm -hmm. Good morning, Conchan. Don't call him Conchan. Say officer. It's all right. Because my name is Kondo. Obey the laws. Two persons are not allowed to ride on a bike. I'm sorry, because we're in a hurry. What do you mean, this early morning? I see. I think you're up to something again, as usual. That's not true. We are going to find a spaceship. A spaceship? Yes. Don't be silly. We saw it last night. It's true. It came down by the riverside. I see, I see, I see. I'll tell you what. Remember, the next time if you are naughty again, I'll shave your heads. Yeah. Remember? Okay. Now take this back. You can go now. But walk, walk. Yes. That's good. Right, let's climb from here. Wait for me. Come on. 
What? It's only a rabbit. It's cute. Let me catch it. You can't, you idiot. She's too fast. Come on, let's go. Inside. Don't go inside. Aren't you scared of the spacemen? You fool. The spacemen are well civilized and they won't make such a trouble. Don't be so dumb. Excuse me. Hello. Don't think that they understand our language. Don't be so dumb. What are you talking about? I wonder what happened to the crew. I think they went out for a while. Oh boy, that's great. Hey, it's working. Imagine traveling in this. Isn't that great? Yeah, it's great. Now for the countdown. Stand by for takeoff. Okay. Okay, let's go. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, 0. Because where was Gamera? Right, because Gamera is our friend. Right, it's awfully fast. Is it Mach 3? No, that's not right. It's overspace speed. Even Apollo 8, the moon rocket, was Mach 33. 
I see. That surprised me. We leave the solar system at Mach 50. Let's go, Gamma! Gamma! It's getting faster all the time. I wonder why it's getting faster. Because of remote control, I guess. Akio, look at Gamma's jet propulsion. Gamma, keep it up! What should we do? Maybe the spaceship is going faster all the time. Gamera! Gamera! Help us! Mother! Mother! My, my, such a loud voice. Where were you without my permission? Mother, it's about a big trouble. Did Akio tease you again? No, Akio and Tom went in a spaceship, Mother. Don't tell me such a silly story like Akio and Tom. It's true. We found a spaceship near the river, and they went inside. It lit up suddenly, and... I see. Akio's up to something again. Please, tell me something. Don't you believe in spaceships and spacemen, you know? No, I don't. But the paper said a lot of people saw flying saucers. Don't you know it? They are all made up stories. But, Mother! Stop it. Study or you cannot enter a good school. Poor boys. I wonder where they are now. I guess. Akio, we're safe. Are you all right? I'm okay. 
Hey, look, the hatch is open. Then there must be air in here. Look, we're all right without any space clothing on. I wonder if we're back on Earth again. Oh, well, let's go out and see. Akio, I wonder where we are. We're not on Earth, that's for sure. Is it Mars or Venus? No, Mars or Venus doesn't have any atmosphere like we have on Earth. Lucky the atmosphere saved us. This must be a big star. And there are stars like Earth, and we are the first who found a new star. That's right. Wait, be careful. We were brought over here by remote control, and we have to watch out. It's in different color, so it must be a space kiosk. It's awful. What should we do? Look. Look. The water's running backwards. trying to attack from behind. Watch! But that one doesn't move at all. Oh, here it comes, flying low. I guess it's too smelly to eat. It's going back to the place where it came from. Where 
come from? Watch oh, out! Sure. Tom! The opposite switch! Look, the water's returning. on this planet anyway. I'm not quite sure, but I think we're on a highly civilized star. Moving instantly. That's great. Okay, let's investigate some more places. Boy, it's great. What's that sound? Somebody is here, I guess. Hey! Anybody around? Please answer! Idiot. They won't understand our language. You know, they're spacemen. Akio, what if goblins come? What should we do? Don't worry. One, look. It's a moving corridor. I see. Let's get on it. Okay. Boy, it's wonderful. Maybe this is the control center. Hmm. where we are? Can you tell us who you are? I see. We can't understand our language. We were waiting for you to come. Hey, how come you can speak our language all of a sudden? Look, this speaking machine translates all kinds of languages. Oh, boy. I believe science has advanced here more than on Earth. I guess so. Please tell us, what star are we on? How far are we from the Earth? We call the star Terra. 
It's on the opposite side of the Earth where you are living, exactly like the Earth with the sun between, same size and moving like the Earth. So you mean to tell us that it's like a twin star then? I wondered if there was such a star. I see, Tom, on the other side of the sun. They never see each other. I wonder why. Akio, this is a big discovery. Right. So the planets of the solar system are Mercury, Venus, Earth, Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, Neptune, Pluto. That's nine planets altogether, and Terra makes the tenth. That's right. Look, it's Gios again. Barbella, it's so noisy. Let it out again. Yes. Is your name Miss Barbella? Right, and it means as sweet as a little bird. And I'm Florbella. It means pretty as a flower. Where are the others then? Ah, Akio, look, it's the same as before. It's funny that the water is running backwards. It's against the laws of gravity. Over here, we control the laws of nature. Oh, what a superior civilization. You know, I looked in my telescope every day, and I thought there'd be a perfect planet without work and wars and traffic accidents, and I've been believing it up to this day. It's that monster again. That's our watchdog, Giran, and we can control it the way we want to. Look, Gios is running. Can you tell me why there are monsters in such a civilized place like this? I'll tell you what, in our world, it, it was a well-advanced society. We could even control the laws of nature with electronic brains. But a mix-up in the computer brought calamity. And also it made uncontrollable monsters too. Is, Is that, that so? We sent out messages for help several times, but we received no answer at all. So. That must have been the wave that Dr. Shige was talking about. Hmm. So those alive got on a big spaceship to find another star to live on, but it fell. So only we two are left. But we found out that a small spaceship was still working, and when we called it back, you two were on it. I see. We can only live here on this space base right now. Take a look. It will be getting colder from now on. Within five hours, it will be bound in by glaciers. Barbella? Over here, that used to be a city a very long time ago. Right now, it's the monster's home. You two, let's go back to the Earth together. Otherwise... Thanks. We'll check the ship and go before it freezes over here. Akio, we're really lucky. Right. If only Gamera could be here. I think Gamera is looking for us. room above the control center. Take a rest while we repair the ship. All right.
Florbella. The ship only holds two. And we don't have any room for the two boys. I know. And don't worry, because we still have enough time yet. Before that, I'll check if they are poisonous or not to eat. If not, we will make them our rations. Go and go and check the ship. Oh, I'm really hungry. I wonder if we can really go home. Don't worry. The girl said we can go as soon as the spaceship is repaired. I know, but won't they be surprised to see such groovy space girls when we get over there? Right, Akio? Akio, what's the matter? That's funny. Now, my boy, you have to answer my questions now. Yes. Tell me, what would you like the most right now? Come on, don't be shy. What's the matter? Come on, answer me. I see you're hungry. I'll fix you something, but answer my questions until it's ready. Yes. Is it hurting you? No, it feels nice. I see. Akio, what's the matter, Akio? Akio, what's the matter? What's the matter, Akio? Akio! I'll Akio. fix that naughty kid. Akio! Akio! You knew about Gyos before, but are there many monsters on Earth like Gyos? Not now. Gamera got them all. What is Gamera? You said it's looking for you. Come on, tell me. Come on. Gamera is the friend of children. The friend of children? Yes. He always appears when we need him. On time. A long time ago, he saved the child in Hokkaido. He knocked out Gaius, and Gaius tried to eat the children. Save the lives of the two boys also.
funny? I'm sure you stopped suddenly moving. I'm sure of it. You know, I had a feeling that I ate a lot of mother's donuts at that time. Your mother's donuts are really good. Say, I'm hungry. I'm starving to death. I'm thirsty. How about the ship? It's okay. We can leave any time. That's good. Prepare some food according to the instructions of this card and use sleeping powder. Sleeping powder? Right. And we can't waste any time because while they are sleeping, we'll eat their brains raw. You mean their brains? All their knowledge, which is given to them, is stored up in their brains. And we can use this knowledge when we go to the Earth for our plans. It's the same thing like the bacteria over here who became the higher animal. I see. Good afternoon. I came to pick up Tom. Hello, Elsa. Hello. Thank you for keeping him. Thank you again. Not at all. Sorry to say, but uh, Tom went out with Aki and they haven't returned. I see. But where did they go? Does Tomoko know about it? No. And there's no use to ask her. They told her not to tell. She only speaks nonsense about space. You said space? Yeah. And Tom said that he wants to stay with us much longer. So he must have run away knowing that you're coming to pick him up. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I'm sure he did. Ugh. If you wouldn't mind, he can stay much longer. Thank you. If you wouldn't mind, please, let him stay. Elsa, please drop in for tea. Thanks, but I'm in a hurry. I see. I'll see you then. Take care of yourself. Hello. Why, Tomoko? They really went away in a spaceship. Tomoko, can you tell me more about it? Yes. Conchon, Conchon, please help us. Hmm? What? Hurry, oh, hurry. Oh, 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 what, what happened? What? Come on, hurry. What's this? I hope these people will be more careful. that flying saucers were all made up stories, you see, or just delusions. So, Tomoko, please, tell us the right story. But I'm not lying, and I saw it with my own eyes. Tomoko, don't you know what the Apollo spaceship men said? That Earth is the only oasis in space. There are no living things elsewhere, and no spacemen either. Oh, my God. You believe me, don't you? Yes. I believe you. You're a good girl. You wouldn't lie. I'm sure you wouldn't lie. I'm sure that you're a good girl. Okay? I'll find your brother. Okay? I'll look at the observatory. Thank you, Konchan. Tell me, are you taking a child's word? 
ask the observatory. But please... Uh... What do you mean, idiot? I'm surprised you believe such stories. I'm sure the kids must be playing around this area. Why don't you send a patrol out and find them? Of course them? I will. But first you... Are you sure? Yes. You know that yourself. That pretending to believe them is bad from an educational standpoint. But can't you understand how serious Tomiko is about all this? Forget it. Here you are. Hungry, aren't you? Mmm. Oh boy, my favorite donut. Really looks good. Look, they're just like my mother's donuts. Please, please eat them. Thank you very much. Wait a minute. Is anything wrong? Be still. Akio, I thought I heard Gamera coming. What? I didn't hear him. Must have been my imagination. Come on, let's see. here and remove the skull. a friend of the children. I wonder if he's here to help those kids. Something else to worry about. That's all right. Let's take care of it first.
have the monsters fight each other. Let's gear it out. Let's cook those kids or else. Wait. It's funny. There's something wrong. Gomer put the spaceship out of order. That's the only ship we've got left. If it won't blast off, then what? Anyway, let's eat the kids later, and let's fix the spacecraft first. It's awful. Akio, Akio, Akio. Okay. It hurts. Hey, what happened to my hair? There's no time for that. Those girls were cannibals. What? They were not fixing the ship for us to go back to Earth, but to go eat the people. Come on, let's run away. But my head. Here, wear this. Tom, wait a minute. Tom, where are those kids? 
kids over there. They're trying to run away. Now they know about us, I guess. No, we can't let them get away. Let's run. Run! Akio, how did you do that? I pushed the reverse button. <laughs> hey! Look! Hooray! They're gone! Let's break the handle so they won't be able to come back again. Okay. Never come back again? Yeah. Bad boy. How did you get back since we broke the handle? Use your head, kids. We made a round trip. Tom, let's run. Don't move. Hey, let me go. We're not good to eat. I wonder, where did they go? They even have the police worried. If they come back, I'll spank Tom. Thirty times is punishment. I'm very sorry. It's not your fault. I hope they return safely. Where's the little girl? Ah, oh, that's her. Tomogo, over there. Okay, Tomogo. Tomogo, come on here. Come here. Tell us about that spaceship that, uh, you saw, right? Come on, tell. Come on, tell me. Who are you? Oh, are you Akio's mother? The observation report said that a spaceship flew up near here this morning. We received a report from the police, too. So we want to make sure about, about the boys. Oh, no. Elsa, it seems to be true. Tomoko? Can you tell us the story, okay? So, where did the spaceship go then? Ah, uh, we don't know. People said that it flew very fast and disappeared down the sky. And we only know about the mysterious waves that we caught. Tomoko, come on. Let's talk. Tomoko, come on. Come on, tell us. Tomoko. Was it round? Did it look like a rocket or something like this? Yeah. Come on, you saw it. You sure you saw it, right? Go off right away with the boys. Come on, tell us. What should we do? Can't go back to Earth anymore. I miss Mother. Don't be so cowardly. We've got to find some way to get out of here. I wish Gamera would come to help us. Why doesn't he come? Why don't you keep quiet? Keep quiet. Gamera! Gamera! Got it. 
shoot it at that switch. Oh, I see. Okay. I missed it. That's too bad. How many bullets do you have left? Three more. Leave it to me. Let's escape to the Earth by this. What are we going to do with those kids? Leave them here. There are lots of them on Earth. Come on, hurry. to die.
It's no good up front. with them. Makes me mad. If we only had a weapon, I get that Gurian. Akio, wishful thinking is no good. Wait. It surprises me that Gamera is still alive. makes me mad. This will be the last way. I'll get them this time.
Get that I can't believe it. Doctor, I saw Gamma in our telescope. What? He's holding the ship in his mouth. <laughs> it's almost unbelievable. But the boys were taken exactly from here. It's pretty hard to believe. You better believe it. Well, I hope Tomoko is right. <laughs> Gentlemen, please believe Tomoko's story. You know, Gamera is a good friend of hers. Yes. <laughs> Konchan. <laughs> what, Tomoko? Thank you. That's okay, Tommy Cole. Really surprised. Where's the place? On top of the hill. Thank you. Why, you must be the two boys' mothers. Yes. I'm Akio's mother. I'm glad to know you. Uh, it's unbelievable, but Gomer is heading this way with a spaceship in his mouth. What? Oh, that's that's unbelievable. Look, it's Gamera. Oh, look. Yeah, that's right. It's really, there's his coming. Oh, yeah. Tomoko, watch out. Tomoko! Mother! Elsa, it's hard to believe. 
believe, but we really should have believed our children. I think so, too. My glasses? It's all right. You know, when I'm happy with my glasses, they always come down. <laughs> <laughs> You shaved your head before I could do it, huh? The spacemen, they shaved it off. Is that right? Listen, listen. Huh? Concha, there are spacemen too, like you. Right, Concha? <laughs> <laughs> Akio, Tom. Hey, Dr. Shiga, we discovered a planet and saw space people too. We thought that there were civilized, peaceful planets. More than the Earth where we are living now. But, as a result, I like Earth best. Mm -hmm. Dr. Shiga, we belong to the Earth. And we should forget about the other planets. Let's make the Earth a free place to live. Without war and traffic accidents for the sake of the human beings. And learn by it. Oh, that was a very good experience. Yes, sir. <laughs> 